I'm Paul. Yeah. What's up? How are you doing, bro? Yeah. What's going on? Okay. We want to end SARS hey, once Paul. and for all and forever. But how does it end? Yes. Then? See, see, it's not to just put it on paper or just say it. Pronounce it, sign it, put it into bill. Exactly. That's what we're asking. So even if the, after the president spoke, that's not enough. After that, oh. then we will not talk about reformation. Okay. Stop paying people's parents sixty thousand naira mm. and keep them on the street twenty-four hours daily. Okay. What it happen? This is what we are saying. And stop, stop increasing price of anything. Okay? You just keep increasing fuel, tariff on power. What if, what if it be that? Roads, they not do. Not they do road. So let's leave it. Let's limit it to SARS for now. Okay. Uh, so our SARS on the beat. Okay. We'll come back and put it on the beat. The other one. David was with the ID yesterday. What did that good enough? No, that was not good enough. David was with the ID yesterday about planning for this. Oh, yes, yes, we heard that. And of course, it's, it's, enough? it's still not enough. It's, yeah, they need enough. to hear our collective voices. Okay. It's very, very important so that they'll know that it goes beyond an individual. Okay. They are not dealing with the youth. And she that also they're lazy. This is the right time to prove to them that these people, they are not lazy. You see that song where they sing, who say we tire? Now rest with the rest, JJ. Okay. So we don't tire to rest now. All right. Now let them do what they have to do. All right. We want to see action. We don't wake up. Okay. So AY Maku and the other side, Paul. They're all here. Paul Okoye. From people, they're all here saying enough is enough. And they're screaming. idea is to walk on the toll bridge, the lucky toll area, to the government residence at the marina. Thousands of young men and women, men and women from all walks of life here. There are some celebrities here. There's a Banky W and there's the other half of the P Square. And a lot of very intelligent and smart like Young men and women in Nigeria. How are you doing, sir? I'm doing good. So what's going on here? We are protesting to end this SARS issue. But hasn't it ended? No, we haven't. We want to hear from our president. Oh, he, spoke, he spoke yesterday, didn't no, you hear? No, no, we want to hear. We should, we should, we should end it. We don't want to reform the SARS. All right, thank you. So guys, as you can see, they are determined. They say there's no going back, no letting up. They want to hear. The steps I will be taking to end it once and for all. We need change. We need to end to police brutality. That's right. Don't you already have it? So what? Don't you already have the end to it? No, 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 no. We don't have to do it. Okay. Well done.
meet you. Police is your friend, brother. Yes, some, some, some. So tell me what's going on here now. Um, it's a protest. It's a about protest against police brutality, against police extrajudicial killings, against extortion, against everything illegal that the police has been doing. Okay. You understand? Look, some people will say uh, there are other problems in Nigeria that we need to face. Should be the person where they are alive, they have to face problems. So who do we meet on the streets every day when we go out? The police. So are you not concerned okay. about the police welfare? Their police own welfare? welfare. Bros. If you tell me about police welfare, is police concerned about my welfare? Is police concerned about the welfare of these people? And all of us, they suffer, they suffer. And then before you joined the police, you knew about the welfare, you knew it was not good. And you still joined it. You understand? So we're concerned about your welfare. If you check the police reform bill, part of it, part of the police reform bill is actually for, <laughs> is actually for payment, increase the payment for the police and their welfare. That's why we're, it's part of this whole fight. So we are still fighting for the police. But it's unfortunate some of them on the streets do not know this. All right, well done. Thank you. Oh, God, 
What's the plan? Uh, I believe it, that will be made known to them. The authorities will working on How quickly would that be seeing that the Nigerian youth are up and running? As, as fast as possible. In fact, without delay, without wasting time. Sir, Nigerian young men and women are desperate. They love the police. But they also want to know that they are safe in their own country. Now, seeing that the police doesn't get what it deserves, what should the young men and women go, go away from here with? Seeing that even after the IG spoke, some policemen were still careless with their weapons. No, 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 please. The police will not deviate from our traditional duty of protection of our people. I assure you, we will not leave that on them. Okay. And if we are not been doing it the way Nigerians expect, we are going to do it better this time around. But you know that Nigerian young men and women love you. We know. We they know. are just and tired. And we love Nigerians too. So what are you... We love Nigerians, we love all the youth, everybody. What's the assurance uh, that this will stay that way? It will stay. And we assure you of adequate and effective protection. Sir, the, the police officers that were involved in the shooting at Sulere, would they be brought to justice? Well, I, I, I don't know about that, but whoever has a wrong file of the law will be brought to justice. Yeah, what about the victims? Will anything, money compensation go to their families or anything? I, I, I'm not privy of this thing you are saying, but whatever has not been done properly, we don't Okay, thank you, sir. Hi, phone are gone. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Oh, yeah, boy, 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 boy